Dr. Pimple Popper is the Wonder Woman of medical reality shows, but even superheroes have their embarrassing moments, as we have made a compilation of such moments. Welcome to Film Time, the greatest hour to know everything about your favorite TV series, reality shows, and entertaining news about your favorite celebrities. If you liked the video, we would greatly appreciate it if you clicked the like icon. And if you like content like this, never miss an update by subscribing to our channel below. Dr. Sandra Lee, aka Dr. Pimple Popper, is the professional dermatologist we all hope to be. But there are moments when the famed dermatologist might make you feel secondhand embarrassment just by watching her. From food pun titles to overexcitement at cases, she's got it all. So, here are Dr. Lee's most embarrassing moments on Dr. Pimple Popper. Number 1. Witty Nature Backfires One of the things that are consistent with Dr. Lee while treating her patients is her inability to stop talking. According to her, she chats with her patients to make them feel comfortable, and she often encourages her patients to respond to get their minds off any discomfort. But Dr. Lee wasn't prepared for an elderly patient that wouldn't respond to any of her questions while she extracts his blackheads. It was awkward watching Dr. Lee try to fill room with any topics that the man could be interested in. Too bad the elderly man was not there to meet a chatty doctor, and his reluctant grunts and growls confirm our theory. Number 2. Playdate with Growth Dr. Lee shows her playful skills when she had a playdate with a growth she pulled out of a patient's body. The patient had sought Dr. Lee's help to help extract a lipoma from their back. The good doctor proceeded to help the patient and extract the lipoma, but she decided to pull an embarrassing card when she started playing with the mass content that she had extracted from the patient's back, going as far as walking around with it. Number 3. Keloid Saga Dr. Lee continued her streak of embarrassing moments of asking her patients to touch the mass content she pulls from their growths. She had tweeted that she finds importance in telling a patient to hold whatever she removes from them, which let's agree it's a bit embarrassing. And we had patients flatly refuse to do so, embarrassing Dr. Lee in the process. A case in point is this particular patient that had refused to touch the keloids Dr. Lee removed from her ear. Although that's to be expected as she had removed more than enough skin when cutting the keloids from the patient's ear. Number 4. Diamond Pun Let's be real, Dr. Lee has a way with words in a way that we would never know, especially if those words would have caused us embarrassment or an eye roll. The famed dermatologist once told a patient that the skin under their blackhead could be used to smuggle diamonds in a tone that was supposed to be playful, but ended up embarrassing the patient. It was clearly a playful jab, but we do not think the patient appreciates the jab based on the look she gave Dr. Lee afterward. Number 5. Embarrassing Titles The first rule to being a popaholic is you may have to let go of every food that you know. Dr. Lee sure knows how to give the titles to her cases in a way that is cringeworthy at best. From Shamu the Whale to Avocado Bump, there are a lot of embarrassing titles out there. The famed dermatologist once referred to a gooey content that came out of a growth alien, although her overexcitement at the cysts on the patient's back has already caused enough embarrassment for the patient before the weird alien calls. Number 6. Jumping Cyst Watching Dr. Lee jump in excitement over a cyst is sure to make anyone feel embarrassed, not just the patients, but her assistants too. But what makes this case peculiar is the fact that the cyst Dr. Lee was trying to squeeze out also jumped in excitement right as Dr. Lee squeezed it out at the patient's back. Talk about an overexcited cyst ready to meet the person that just evicted it out of its residence. Number 7. Dinner Plans Popaholics can't even think about food while watching Dr. Pimple Popper, but it seems Dr. Lee does not share the same sentiment as the famed dermatologist had no problem talking about dinner when a patient sought her help to remove a cyst just as she's squeezing out the cyst. Judging by the look on her patient and the assistant's face, only Dr. Lee could think about food at such a gross moment. There you have it guys, Dr. Lee's most embarrassing moments on Dr. Pimple Popper. Did you enjoy the video? Which of these moments surprised you? And which other moments did we miss? Share your opinions with other popaholics in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, please don't hesitate to click the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content just like this. You can also turn on the notification bell to not miss any updates of our future posts. 
We hope to see you again soon. Adios.